Welcome to your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Be sure to check out your exclusive discount offer at the end of your free lesson. As long as you have the owner permission to a public folder, you can administer it. You can perform various administrative activities like setting the initial view of the folder for the other users, adding a link to the folder to your contacts folder, or changing whether the folder is accessible by all users or just the owners. All of these properties can be set by clicking the Administration tab in the Folders Properties dialog box. To access that dialog box, right-click on any one of the public folders that you wish to administer, then choose Properties from the pop-up menu that appears with a left-click. That'll bring up the Folders Properties dialog box, where you can click the Administration tab. And on this tab, you can use the Initial View on Folder drop-down at the top, to set what the view of the folder should be when a user first opens the folder. So should it just be normal, grouped by the from field, the subject field, or in this case maybe grouped by conversation topic for shared discussions. You use the drag drop posting as a drop down to select either forward or move copy. This sets how an item appears when a user moves or copies an item into the folder. The forward option sets the item to appear to be from the user who moved or copied the item. The move copy option sets the item to appear to be from the person who originally posted the item. You can click the contacts button to add the folder to your contacts folder as an actual contact. That way you can send Outlook items directly to that folder. In the this folder is available to section, choose the option button that corresponds to whom you want to allow access to the folder. You can choose owners only while you're creating or editing the folder as any messages or items that the individuals would try to send to the folder would be returned with a message letting them know that the folder is only available to folder owners at that time. And so that way you can work on the folder before actually distributing it or allowing people access. You can also just choose all users with access permission when you're finished. Clicking the Folder Assistant button will launch the Folder Assistant dialog box where you can change the rules that dictate how items would be processed in this folder. We're going to look at setting rules in another lesson, but note that here's where we can add them. Clicking the Moderated Folder button allows you to select a moderator for the folder. A moderator is an individual who reviews items that are posted to the folder before allowing them to be posted. To set a moderator, click the Set Folder Up as a Moderated Folder checkbox first. Below that then, click the To button and select the names of the individuals who will be moderating the folder. Then click OK. If you want the users who post to the moderated folder, to receive a reply, you can check the Reply to New Items With checkbox, and then you either have to select Standard Response or Custom Response below that. If you select Custom Response, you will then have to create the body of the email message that you want to use as a template by clicking the Template button and then typing in a message. or you can simply choose the standard response, in which case it will just let them know via a standard email that their item has been received and will be posted after being moderated by the moderator. In the moderator section, click the Add button to add the names of the individuals who will have the ability to move the items back into the folder after they've reviewed the material for submission. Then click OK in the Moderated Folder dialog box to set the folder's moderation properties, and then click OK in the Properties dialog box to return to the shared folder. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Like what you see? Pick up your copy of our complete tutorial today and be sure to visit us at www.teachucomp.com slash YouTube for your special bonus offer. 
Our complete tutorial featuring introductory through advanced material is available on CD-ROM or digital download. You will receive our high-quality video lessons plus printable instruction manuals in one easy-to-use training package. With over two dozen titles to choose from, you'll be sure to find the training you need in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more. Visit us today!